Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, this is Billy from uh, CMB po- uh, News Podcast. Um, I'm coming in here late. Uh, I just got through watching um, Night of Champions, WWE's um, Night of Champions. Uh, very good uh, pay per view. Um, so let's get down. Let's get down to news. Um, West Monroe. I mean, um, Sterling has named Brian West a former West Monroe um, alumni. Um, went to West Monroe, went to the pros, um, played with the White Sox. Uh, he was um, he was former introduced as the new softball coach at Sarleton this past week. Um, and other news: a uh, worst tall softball coach got got the former coach at um, Sarleton, um, uh, Coach um, Hitman. Uh, she is over at worst tall. Um, good, you know. I'm. I'm Wish both of them well. Um, so, in wrestling news, um, AEW will be adding a third show to its um, lineup uh, called AEW Collision. Uh, I think it debuts next month um, in Chicago, which the rumor is uh, CM Punk might be back with AEW. Um, have to wait and see. Um, but when that when that do come and available, I will be um, giving more um, information on that. Um, y'all notice I've changed my location. I'm in the new podcast room. Um, I'm using off to off to my bedroom here as my new podcast um, room. Um, BAW will be coming back to Oak Grove. Um, on. Uh, August the 19th, 2023. Get your tickets um, when they go on sale. Uh, they will be at the logo at the legal uh, the logo center there at in Oak Grove. I think it's going to be a packed house. Um, when more details come available, I will be coming on the podcast. I know I did um, say I was going to get an interview today with uh, Ray the Blade. Something came up with him, but I am going to talk to him Monday. So as soon as that part, as soon as I get the interview, I can upload it and let y'all watch it. Um, we're selling B I uh, C and B nose T-shirts for twenty six dollars. If you want some, um, you you can email me or you can um uh. Message me on Messenger, um, Billy, uh, Gullet at um, on Messenger. I'd be glad to, um, you know, get order your shirt. You can order one, um, small, medium, large, extra large. Um, they're twenty six dollars um, as the highest. Uh, but that's my prescribe my my. Uh, my my grandson's uh, grand um, mother is doing my shirt for me. Uh, she has the equipment to do the shirts. So, so um, I know. Uh, like I said, I know football season's right around the corner. Uh, we're gonna be more on this podcast than what we are now. I'm just trying. You know, this is uh, football. You know, like I said, BIW is coming. To um, Oak Grove, uh, Fountain Hill, on the seventeenth, and the following night, on the following day, Father's Day, on June eighteenth, uh, they will be in West Monroe. You can get your tickets. Um, and if you're in, if you're in, if you want to go to the Fountain Hill show, go to Judy's Diner there in Oak Grove. Um, out there in Fountain Hill and get your tickets there or if you go and come to the West Monroe show you can um, go by um, the Carwell Banker Group um, there on North on Cypress Street um, and see Josh um, Newsom he would give your uh, see your tickets um, so go out there and let's support Josh on his this will be his 16th year um, Promoting BIW um, here and you know local, so um, 
I'm heard he might be back in El Arreda. We don't know yet, but you know we we're, we're hoping we get El Arreda. We can get in Shreveport with BIW. Um, that'd be those uh, so stomping grounds of Mid South wrestling back in when I was growing up back in um, the early eight, 1980s. Um, like I said, WWE United Champions. Uh, we have New World Champion was crowned. Um, Seth Rollins beat AJ Styles. Great match, y'all. It went both way anyway. But uh, Seth Rollins is the new World Champion. Um, that my understanding of that title will be exclusive to Raw. Um, Becky Lynch um, lost to Trish Stratus. That that was that, that was a great match, y'all. It, it could be, went either way. Like I said, um, I will give that a B plus match. Um, you know, um, then an IC title match. G Gunner Gunther beat um, Ali. Uh, <laughs> it, that was just a squash match, y'all. That was just a brutal match. It was a great match. Then for the women's uh, women WWE Raw Women's Champ Championship, we have a new champion, Oscar. Uh, beat uh, Bel Air. Um, great match. I'll give it a give it five pl uh, five stars on that match. And Ripley beat Natty. Natty. Uh, that was just a squash match, y'all. I don't know what WWE was thinking, but Brock Lesnar beat Cody Rhodes. Uh, Cody was injured, um, had a hurt arm, um, but he um, he almost won the match, y'all. But he, but he did not tap out. He did pass out. So um, Brock Lesnar, I look for another match between these two guys to settle it. Um, and the women uh, for the world tag team titles, um, Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens kept the titles. Beat um, Roman Reigns and Solo. Um, so, like I said, in the next couple of weeks, um, we're going to go some more rundowns on the these VIW shows. Um, I got some more, sh um, I'm trying to get some interviews with some of these, um, BIW stars. Uh, I'm trying to get one with Tim S uh, Storm, um, former NWA champion, um, and so I'm gonna try to get that up as far you know, get that. We can get that. Um, so uh, if you, if y'all are in the Dallas, if y'all are in the Texas area, um, three uh, three sixty is putting it on a show in Texas. Um, my, the pretty young things, uh, Ray the Blade and Nike will defend their titles against the Dark Circus. I don't know anything about the Dark Circus. I'm going to ask him when I do do the um, interview about this Dark Circus. See um, what they're all about. And y'all can hear it firsthand uh, Monday as soon as the interview is done. Um, so um, then you got uh, Will All Day um, versus um, Alex Arsenal and versus. Um, Adam Cole, um, Adam Cole uh, Jace, uh, um Alexander versus Super Tits. That should be a great match, y'all. I don't know nothing about these guys, but seem like they're good athletes. Um, so, if you're in the Texas area, go and support 360 Pro Wrestling. Uh, if you're in Monroe, if you're in West Monroe, um, or in El, um, Fountain Hill, Arkansas on the 17th, 18th, come uh, support Josh in his effort with this BIW. Um, like I said, this is Marcus' 16th show, uh, 16th year in the business. Um, uh, CMB knows it's going to be there. If y'all see me and my wife, we'll, we'll be having the CB, uh, CMB know shirts on. Come up, talk to uh, Speak to us, um, you know. If you want to order shirts, let me know. I will try to get some forms um, printed out or made up, and where y'all can um, get them. So that's you know, like I said, I'm, I'm gonna hop on here tonight, just do a little, little a little uh, podcast, um, a little uh, update on the wrestling today. Um, I think LSU uh, was knocked out of the 
SEC tournament by Texas A&M. Um, Texas A&M was playing Arkansas earlier. Um, Arkansas was getting beat, I think, 4-1. Um, I will have to go later on check that score. I feel, you know, like I said, we are, you know, Monday, be back on here Monday night or Monday afternoon up, um, uploading a video with the interview with um, Ray the Blade. Um, so, like I said, this is Billy from uh, CMB Knows Podcast. Um, as the news come, like I said, football season right around the corner. Um, uh, go. Also, uh, before I get out of here, let me say um, if y'all if y'all want any uh, cups um, or you staplers, you can go buy a stapler and you know send it to um, April Davis at um, Amazing Grace um, Designs. Uh, she was in um, Arcadia today. Um, at the Bonnie and Clyde trade um, days, um, so you see this right here. Um, this is my stapler with LSU. I'm a big LSU fan. Um, see, so can I get a pay me a West Monroe one? Uh, like you know, um, like I said, contact her. Amazing Grace Designs, um, April Davis. Um, if you want your yard cut. Line service, uh, Sam um, service three three one eight two three five seven two three four, or um, Taylor Made Ministries. Me and my wife got some uh, uh, chicken salad today. Uh, we've already eaten one bowl of it. <laughs> Making some sandwiches that are very good. Um, I mean, he's very reasonable on his prices. Um, we're gonna get some some other pork chops. Hey, that's some other pork chops, rice and gravy, uh, mashed potatoes, uh, cornbread, uh, rolls, or what, you know, if you ask for rolls, he gets you the roll, make you the rolls. Um, I'm going to try to sit down, I'm going to try to get him to uh, write down me a menu, I can go over the menu, with, put it on the podcast um, in the next couple of weeks. So, like I said, if y'all want any cups, she has a lot of cups. She has some cups. Uh, she has key rings, uh, stuff like that. She has got some new items. Um, she has t-shirts. Um, so next week or Monday, like I said, I will try to get more information um, about this. Um, this 360 uh, show coming up in Texas. For uh, Razor Blade, um, I don't know if Nike's gonna be there or not, but I think Razor Blade, Razor Blade is gonna be there um, doing this interview with me. Um, if y'all, if y'all ever um, y'all go back and watch one of our previous interviews, um, you know he's a real good guy. Um, he's a local guy, but he wrestle, He's been trying to get BIW, but being the, uh, it's hard to get into BIW. Um, with Josh, because you know he, I'm not saying Rage Blade is not a great talent, but you know he puts his in year uh, like a year in advance. Um, but the card is going to be stacked for um, Fountain Hill, um, uh, West Monroe. Um, so they come back to West Monroe in September. Um, CMB knows uh, podcast will be sponsoring that show again uh we're gonna be sponsoring the um oak grow show um so we, if i don't make the show um, but i'm praying i'm i'm gonna try to get it off where i can go to that show on that night um i'm not you know like i said i don't know if i'm gonna do i, I know i'm gonna do um podcast next week on monday but i don't know if i'm gonna do one thursday or not but I, it would see if if I get on any. If I'm trying to get some um, wrestling news from New Japan from my uh, reporter Sean Lang. Um, he he updates me on uh, New Japan. He's not sent me no information here lately. So um, I, I was reading where um, the former women's champion 
Sasha Banks uh, was injured and lost the title to Willow um, Nightingale of AEW um, this past about a week ago. So, you know, it's going to be great, y'all. So, get out there and support um, BIW uh, in June, um, August. Go to Oak Grove and support them. If y'all, if y'all come support uh, CMB Knows Podcast, uh, get the t-shirts. Um, like I said, $26. Um, so, thank y'all. God bless y'all. And we'll see y'all Monday with the upload on the video with Raid the Blade. I'll go one-on-one with Raid the Blade. So, um, and I'm trying to get an interview lined up with... Uh, John, uh, talk about uh, uh, VS, VCW. Um, so, if y'all will support, um, go out there. And so, like I said, subscribe to the podcast. Um, got some friends, let them know about the CMB Knows podcast. Um, I'm gonna give a shout out to my friend Cody, and um, I, I know he's been on the weather. I, I know he has a surgery done, so get re- uh, get uh, well, brother. Um, April, I tell Jackson we love him. Grandpa, um, Grandpa loves Jackson, and so we'll see y'all. And oh, my friend um, Lisa, uh, I sent you all the information. Um, soon you see, as soon as I get the money in. Uh, I will order that shirt, and you. Uh, I'll have it into you. Thanks. So thank y'all. Good night, and be and God bless y'all.